So hey guys, what is going on? My name is Jacob from Cinema Camp Productions, and hopefully you guys enjoyed that intro. That's the exact same intro that I used before. This one's just a lot more souped up, and a different logo, obviously, because I have changed my logo since then. So, I'm just going to show you guys everything that just went into that. I'm going to start using this uh, intro for all my desktop tutorials, OBS, and everything else. And just so you guys know, I do have a lot of pre-recorded uh, pre footage, so you might not see this exact wallpaper um, in some footage to come, but um, the intro will still be used because I've been working on this thing for like a week and a half now. Like I mentioned before in the one I made about a year ago, I started off with a C40 file, which is Cinema 4D. And I basically just uh, made a nice little transition. I messed around with the transform options. And we can see here in this one, I ended up using the nail gun. And this one is for, this one's for the actual the logo. So it looks like a nail gun effect, kind of like a nail gun hitting a wall. I think that's what it's supposed to be at least. I liked it. It worked out. And then uh, for the text, I don't remember which one I used, black hole. So it's all being like warped around from left to right back into the center. Kind of like a black hole would, which worked out because the logo was right in the center. From there, obviously, I just rendered that out. It took me about three days to render because every single time I rendered it, it wouldn't work. So I had to pretty much download my own codec and everything and then make it all work out okay. And then we got into the magic money stuff. Okay, so once we got into uh, After Effects, this is where it got a lot of fun. So very first thing that I did was I obviously just added a zoom and a transition. So that little first zoom and that's pretty much all I did at first, just the zoom. It's going to be really bad quality right now because I'm rendering it live. Um, so I did the zoom and then I added the kind of pre-zoom and the blur. If you look right here, it blurs. And then it kind of transitions over to the right a little bit, and then more to the right a little bit, and then it kind of recenters itself. You can see it moving back left right here. And there we go. I added two sets of blurs right there. And then we obviously added our lens flares. You guys can see them up here. Um, so for flare number one, I was using Winter Aurora. And then for flare number two, I was using mini, mini anamorphic. So those are both really freaking awesome, in my opinion, like together. Because just, I mean, look at this, look at this image right here. You can see the like Michael Bay lens flare. You can see the winter aurora going on. And then it, once you get to the very end, it looks, it still just looks freaking amazing. Sadly, this time I wasn't able to do that like shuddering effect that I got in the last one. I don't really know how I did that. It didn't, it wasn't supposed to end up like that. And I liked how it ended, but I didn't really get that effect on this one, sadly, which is okay. But yeah, um, that is it. After that, I just did a little bit of color correction with uh, some mojo and it was a cakewalk. I mean, this is it without color correction. This is it with color correction. So that's what it would have looked like before, after, no lens flare, no lens flare. So basically we started off with just this image and then we added the camera zoom a little bit. We added a little bit of control, which you can't see because that's just video stuff. Uh, we added our blur, which isn't here because this is the end. Um, we added our flare, our flare number two, and color correction. So once we got everything in place, it looks super duper Michael Bay HD, and I liked it. Hope you guys did enjoy this intro. If you guys do want me to uh, make you guys an intro, just let me know. I've been putting that out there for freaking ever, and nobody still wants me to make them one because apparently I suck. So yeah, uh, if you guys did enjoy this video, make sure you guys give that like button a huge render. Also subscribe because I need that in my life. I need to pay the bills. Okay? Okay. Thanks, guys. My name is Jacob from Cinema K Productions, and I'll talk to you guys later. See ya.